Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. When you think of the Ice Age, what's the first animal that comes to mind? For many of us, it's this absolute legend, the saber-toothed cat. With those incredible, knife-like fans, it's one of the most famous prehistoric predators. But what was this magnificent beast really like? Let's travel back in time and find out. First, let's clear up a common mistake. The saber-toothed cat wasn't actually a tiger. Its most famous species, Smaudon fetalis, is a distant cousin to modern big cats. Think of it more like a supersized lion or jaguar, but built way more robustly. Smilodon was a powerhouse short-legged, muscular, with a thick neck and powerful forelimbs. It was built for ambush, not for long-distance chases. Imagine a bear-like cat, and you're getting close to its physique. Now, let's talk about those teeth. The iconic canines could grow up to seven inches long. But they weren't just for show. They were surprisingly fragile and couldn't be used to crunch through bone. Instead, paleontologists believe Smilodon used them for a very specific purpose, a precision killing bite. After wrestling its prey to the ground animals like bison, horses, and even young mammoths, it would deliver a devastating bite to the soft throat, severing major blood vessels. It was a quick, efficient takedown. So why did these incredible predators disappear? Their extinction, around 10,000 years ago, is a real prehistoric mystery. It likely wasn't just one thing, but a combination of factors. The climate was changing rapidly as the Ice Age ended. This caused a major shift in the environment, and many of the large herbivores that Smilodon preyed on began to die out. Less food meant more competition, not just with other predators, but also with a new, highly intelligent hunter on the scene, early humans. The world changed, and sadly, the saber-toothed cat couldn't adapt quickly enough. From its powerful build to its specialized hunting technique, the saber-toothed cat was a true marvel of evolution. It's a powerful reminder of a lost world, one ruled by giants. What prehistoric animal should we explore next? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more adventures into the past. See you next time.